What's good guys, it's Combat here at Infinite Rhythm Productions and today I'm about to show you guys how to enhance your hip hop track, really make this shit stand out. I'm going to show you guys how to use the underwater effect and how to efficiently use it to really highlight sections of your song to really make parts stand out so that way your audience doesn't get bored with maybe a beat that's just kind of repetitive or you really want some spots just to stand out, you feel me? So I'm, I'm just going to show you guys that and how to like enhance a little bit more. Combat, this is a banger, huh? So this is what we have right here. I'm just gonna show you what it sounds like. Guess I'm trending, I'm the topic. Nigga shot it, hit me for the pace, and I ain't got it. Baby, no, every time she went in through that ass, a nigga caught it. I swear to God, I caught some shit, and I'll be mad, and nigga bought it. Like a R&B group, the streets of turn boys to men. Yeah. So this is what it sounded like before that right here. So I'm gonna show you guys. This is what it sounded like before. But watch it from the benches. Guess I'm trending, I'm the topic. Nigga shot it, hit me for the pace, but I ain't got it. Baby, no, every time she went in through that ass, a nigga caught it. I swear to God, I caught some shit, and I... See, and that's cool, but we could just make it so much better, you feel me? So, um, I'm going to show you guys how to get this in right here. The first thing you guys are going to need to do is right-click your track right here and hit Duplicate. Now, you guys, make sure that you have Active Playlist and Alternate Playlist inactivated, just in case. Click that right there. Now, we're going to find the part that we want to highlight. Nigga shot it, hit me for the pace, said I'm on the benches. Guess I'm trending, I'm a topic. Nigga shot it, hit me for the pace, said I ain't got it. Baby, no, every time she. Okay, that's hard. So, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna highlight that section right there, hit Command E, and then drag and drop it down. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to go into one of my plugins. I'm going to use a stock plugin for you guys, the EQ37 band. We, we should all have that in Pro Tools. And we got this open. We're going to go into Automate up over here. It says up over here in the corner. We're going to go all the way down to Low Pass Frequency. And we're going to hit Add. And we're going to hit OK. Now we're going to make sure it's activated. And this is the low pass frequency. This is how we get the underwater effect right here. We're using this EQ. So what we're going to do is we're going to click this little automation button right here. We're going to hit this and we're going to go to low pass frequency. Now we're going to keep this open just so you guys can see. And as you guys can see, if I move this up or move this down, it's going to move with this. It's going to automate. So what I want is I want to drop this all the way down right here. Obviously, it's always to your liking. You feel me? We're going to command click and make another point right here. And we're going to bring this up to create movement and kind of make it feel like it's starting like super underwater and just kind of opening up. You feel me? So we're going to play that out. Watch it from the benches. Guess I'm trending, I'm the topic. Nigga shot it, hit me for the pace, said I ain't got it. Baby, no, every time she went in through that. I see that right there. I swear to God, I caught some shit and I'll be mad. A nigga bought it. Like a Perfect. And if I were to uh, inactivate, this would have sound like. Uh, guess I'm trending, I'm the topic. Nigga shot it, hit me for the pace. But you guys see if I make it active. From the benches. Uh, guess I'm trending, I'm the topic. This literally takes your track to the next level. And then what I'm going to do next is just to enhance a little bit more you feel me i'm gonna take out this part of the beat right here i'm just gonna command e command m let's hear that now that's hella hard but we can make it a little bit better you feel me so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna drag this over over here i'm gonna hit command e and i'm gonna go to my audio suite reverb deverb i'm gonna drop this mix down over here add a little bit decay and hit reverse now i'm gonna exit that out I'm going to go to my grid right here. I'm going to raise this up a little bit. I'm going to give it a nice little fade. You know what I'm saying? Like we're giving it a haircut or something. Just a nice little fade. Then we're going to play it. Game, but watch it from the benches. Uh, guess I'm trending. I'm we could make that even more special. We could kind of make it like start high and then kind of go low. Watch it from the benches. And that is how you do the underwater effect. It will enhance your mixes. And this is using stock plugins. You feel me? So you anyone will be able to do this at home. And that pretty much concludes our tutorial. I hope this helped you guys out. If you guys have any questions, please feel free to hit me up on Instagram at combat underscore K or just leave a comment down below. And if you guys could like, comment, and subscribe, that does help me out a lot so I can continue to help you guys out. Let's get it.